and doing commercial cleaning services, Jeremy realized your lifelong dreams. This is I'm Paul Adams. New Weekly Purpose. Have the control to make it perfect. Competing for the ultimate. At Community First Credit Union, we can meet all your financial needs. How do you meet? I live in Atlanta. I live in Hollywood. But you know, it's like that old... There is no I in T. Tear it up and get it. That's why there's Janikin. As the lead custom-built container to you. We develop Hotzilla. More turns, curves, and split-second finishes. Only Grand Am Road Racing gives... Round of golf for Boo Weekly, his dad, his buddy Toggy, and Arnold Palmer. $240. The golf day. That chunk of grass we're all familiar with. Common courtesy says that you repair your things. I believe in supporting the families of those who have given the ultimate sacrifice to defend our country. At the PGA Tour, we believe in helping others. Because together, anything's possible. Now it's time to walk it across America, presented by Humana. Encouraging them to get out and walk as much of the course of the day as possible, and then come back to us at the end of the day and we'll track their steps, and they may be eligible to win some prizes. 52. This year we plan to be in eight different tournaments and probably track over 20 million steps. She told us that she was helping one of the Lost Boys, so she asked us if we'd like to get involved because he was about to go to the university, and. She knew that I could help him at the university and possibly get scholarships. I know what sweat equity is because I come out here and I work right beside the other volunteers. Even when I'm leading a crew, I lead a crew by showing, not just by pointing and saying, we have to do this. The science of golf is really the understanding of golf and all the different aspects. Science of golf is developing for the future, using all the tools that are amazing today to keep improving. The real long hitters of today, they make a huge shoulder turn and very little hip turn, and then they spring back into the ball. This is why we have mechanical engineers, physicists, rocket scientists, because that golf ball has to see a tremendous amount of load, and then once it leaves the club face, now it has to fly. And I behold once more my old familiar haunts. Here the blue river, the same blue wonder that my infant I admired. Sage doubting whence the traveler came, whence brought his sunny bubbles ere he washed. The fragrant flag fruits in my father's field, and where thereafter in the world he went. This is the third, now, clinic that we'll be adding to our fleet. Primarily be used for uh, disaster relief, but when they're not being used for disaster relief, we're using them for community outreach. So are all you guys ready to get an eye exam today? Yeah! yeah? See that balloon? Hold as still as you can. Nicely done! We have some of the children from the local elementary schools here in the Tampa Bay area to have some fun, get the connection, a healthy sight and an active, healthy lifestyle, but also to uh, have their eyes examined and get fitted with transition lenses if they need them. Mr. Claire, nice to see you. Nice to see you. How are you, my friend? This is my brother, Manuel. Mr. Nice Claire, you. how's it going? Nice to meet you. My dad, Fernando. Fernando, nice to see you, my friend. What a great day. I mean, to be able to spend some time with Mr. Player, my dad, my brother, uh, three individuals that uh, have inspired me and continue to inspire me. What do we play them for? A couple push-ups, maybe? You like those. <laughs> I'm Renee Stubbs, and this is me in 60 seconds. Pee-wee 71, or Pee-wee as my dad calls me. 
Stubbsy is probably the, the one that I'm best known for. Tattoos have long been the mark of rock stars and rebels, but now it seems like just about everyone has a piece of body art to call their own. I think I've just always really liked tattoos. I think it's really a great body art. I think, uh, you know, it's just, uh, it's really personality. I think some people like it, some people don't. She's obviously looking very glamorous in the picture, and that was nice too, in some way sort of charting her rise or the success she's achieved. Though she's a world-class athlete used to being in the spotlight, I've learned a little bit about how to become a professional. There's an approach to this that's much more than jumping in a car and trying to drive fast. I've learned about cars that I never knew mechanical things, and I've learned about team building, and now I'm a team owner. It makes it a lot more difficult. None of this is particularly natural to me. I didn't take any economics or marketing classes in college. I was studying to be a surgeon, so I've had to learn it all on the fly. I spent my whole life racing motorcycles, gone in the desert, off-roading, Racing, racing, racing. I never got involved with sports. I had never even had a paper route because I was gone every weekend doing something motorsports oriented. So I'm embarrassed and a little ashamed to say, but when people go to the bar to root on a football team, I, I really don't even know what's going on. I've been with some friends in fast cars and I didn't like it. My friends all call me grandma. I drive a truck. I think I've had two cars in my whole life and I drive very slow on the street. Everybody always is commenting, aren't you a race car driver? 